find my own stylist. So that's what we working with. Overall. Previously on Ready to Die. and welcome back to my channel i know i'm looking a little boyish or whatever 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 oh hold on let me mute this i've been watching jerry springer okay last week i told y'all that might have been longer than last week i know it's been some time i told you guys that i had another video for another product that we had to do and surprise surprise here we are so for this hair we are actually going to do a detail install which i've never done on my channel before and i have everything prepared for that detail install only thing that i haven't done which is okay because we can do it here together is bleach the lace hence my bleach i literally got it prepared so this video is going to take me less time to make and less time for you guys to watch. Okay, so without keeping you guys waiting any longer, let's go ahead and get into the video. I got the unit. It's, it's not pre-plugged from what I understand. Um, matter of fact, let me just get that pulled up here. This is the Health, health Air. Maybe Health Hair. Health Hair Store. Health, H-E-L-T Hair. I don't know what they was going for. But this is the Deep Wave 360 Lace Front Wig Human Hair for Black Women. 364 lace. And it's pre-plucked. They stated curly natural hairline. And this is the... Okay. This is the 18 inch. As you can see that little number on the corner there. So we got 18 inches, and the reason why we chose to do this one last is because the hair is going to be on our neck. If I need help, I'm going to go get some help too because I don't know nothing about this. But that's this. Now, just per the actual details of the wig, I'm going to put it in the description as I always do. Of course, I'm going to let you guys know the quality. Because the hair gray is 10A. The cap size is 22.5-4-2 inches. The color is black and it can be dyed and bleached. They also have this length available between 18 and 34 inches. So for my long hair girls, they got that 34 for you. It's probably gonna cost you and we're not reviewing that. So I don't know. We're gonna review an 18 inch and see what that gets you. Okay, so best quality can be made in ponytail and bun. So healthy ends, no shedding, no tangle can be restyled easily. So let's get into that wig. Of course, that's the basics of it. This is like one of the only second wigs that we've reviewed on this channel that came with the little tissue paper already in it, kind of like this. And again, the hairline does look really, really pretty. I always like when they have this part go down a little further and come out here like a widow's peak. Like, props to them for that already. If there is any plucking that has to be done, it'll probably be the minimum, so another props to them already the only thing and theirs came in the bag kind of like using grace but again this is hilt hair the bag says you are a beautiful girl and if y'all know my first video that y'all like so much same bag so let's get into it i have not taken the net off of this since two weeks ago i haven't messed with this hair no nothing because i want to do all of that with you guys um we did look at the back of the wig which this was the 360 that they was talking about now <laughs> I still did not know that 360s have this part, but they do. So yeah, um, most important part that we're gonna go ahead and get into first. Oh, my eyebrow itch. Most important part that we're gonna go ahead and get into first is getting this lace bleach. Now there's a slight tint, what it looks to be a tint on the lace, but when you put it on your skin, that's what it's gonna look like, right? And so now we're just gonna go in and give it even more of a HD finish. We are going to get my tree that has been through it and we need another tree. So yeah. Now, while we're getting this big on the tree, I just want to say, like I always do, how have y'all been? I hope everybody is doing amazing. And I hope the new year is treating y'all well. 
let me know down in the comment section also i do have a second youtube channel for those who truly be supporting me and that second youtube channel is strictly for my music so while waiting to do this video i've been doing that and i will also so you may see that in the description for my second channel put that in the description for y'all to check out my music y'all let me know what y'all think over there or over here it don't matter and then y'all know the process using objects we should not use to go ahead and dye this lace y'all know the basics of this so you know let's just and this is gonna be quick because uh that's not a comfortable view but yeah just gonna get that lace dye anyways gonna put the link down below for y'all to check out my other channel and of course you guys know how to do this part the most detailed part of it is how we're gonna go ahead and get our lace melted so y'all can't ever say I didn't give y'all a detailed review. And then y'all know how I like to do it. Get it on there. Especially on the edges. You definitely want it to be on there, right? Well, be sure to be on my IG. So you do not miss it. Well, y'all are my hair queens and kings. So that's either here or... Because we'll be in the studio. We're going to be in the studio. Come on, y'all. Be there or be square. Okay? So, we did the basics of it here, honestly. I think that's as much as the laces we're going to get dyed. Because this is 360, I believe. This is a 13 by 4. Yeah, I did read that. I think it's a 13 by 4. So, Again, the most aggravating part is going to be in the back of my nape. I did not get any uh, lace tape. Because that may have been more comfortable or whatever. But I did not get any. So, that's cool. Okay. And so, now we're going to let that sit for maybe about 10 to 15 minutes. And while we're letting that sit, what we're going to go ahead and do is get our hairline ready with just to make sure we got 70% alcohol we want to make sure the area is clean boom mm -hmm. just go over there real good and this is just going to ensure that it ain't going nowhere okay so I got it real clean real good and now we're just going to have a real quick commercial break the girl Dully best chocolate company for the past 100 years yeah probably longer but yeah anyways just a moment for me being able to eat this chocolate i'm eating this chocolate y'all could take this moment to just let me know like this is so pretty who making chocolate this pretty hmm? 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 but like y'all Okay, no time wasted. I already got my cap on. And this is the cap. I don't know what I'm saying. This to me, I bought it, whatever. But I got this color. It's like an ashy version of my skin tone. But it'll do. Because I don't see why your scalp would look, you know, motion up. So we're just going to go here. Oh, God. Let me be careful. And cut that part. Now, I got these little, these right there. So y'all want to make sure y'all get them out your way. I don't like to put got to be glue like the hair glue on my actual hair anymore up under there. So I just do it like this. Once you get your holes in there, we're just gonna tuck our ears in there. I'm sure y'all know the basics. Okay, now we're gonna put another coat. At least I like to put another coat on my job, but I'm just gonna go ahead like and this time to kind of spread it out in the front. The first one, if you notice, it was like really straight across the front. 
but the, and we just really just want it to be all over now. Give us more closure. Then we're gonna go back in and blow dry that on cool. So for added security, I do like to put my scarf on for the time being, especially since I'm about to go and wash out the bleach off of this lace, which means that we'll need this to just hold this down a little bit extra, even though the blow dryer did the best it can, or the best that it could, because I can't speak today. I don't know. So we're just gonna do this for a few seconds, and also to ensure that this is light enough, let me double check the lace here. I don't know why I'm trying to talk to y'all with the blow dryer, but this is going to take me about 20 to 30 minutes because after I go ahead and blow dry this and wash it out, I got to wash the hair too, just because to make sure they don't get in the hair. And then we'll come back and finish the install. So I don't think y'all need to see me wash the hair. I'm pretty sure. And also, also because I'm about to go and wash this, I seen a young lady in my last video. I'll probably just tag her comment right here because I don't, I don't remember her name. But she stated that she had purchased one of the units that we had reviewed and it was one of the extra long units. I think it was a 30 inch. And she purchased it around the time when I guess I stated I, I bought it. And that means that she had the wig less time than me, but she stated that it was, it tangled up fast and blah, blah, blah. I don't know if you guys know this, but that video that everybody is commenting on with that 30 inch hair, I purchased that hair. Only videos that were sponsored was like uh, the ones that I stated were sponsored. I purchased that hair with my money. So everything that I told you guys, nobody paid me to say it. Like I would like that hair and it did not tangle and I still have the unit. Now what I did hear that she said she was doing was she was shampooing her hair and I'm black. I don't know about y'all. I wash my hair, but I do not shampoo my hair. And I even recently tried to shampoo my hair again. And let me tell you what happened. Exactly what you think happened. My hair got beyond matted. It was so bad because I didn't have no conditioner. I shampooed it. And y'all, I washed it up. And it was like balls in that muff. Like, so if I know my hair is like that, I just, I don't do it with this hair either. I don't know, Brazilian, whomever. But I just feel like shampoo tangles your hair. I guess it works for Caucasian women and that's fine. Y'all pretty, beautiful, but it's not working for black hair and it's definitely not working for your units. So please do not be out here shampooing your units. Okay, all right. So we're gonna condition this one. That's what you see on my bed over there. Strictly conditioner, I do not do shampoo. And we'll be back in 10, okay? Okay, real quick. So I got everything finished there. We're gonna just go ahead and cut this lace. <laughs> my really lips to this, but I don't. So we're just gonna use this because this is okay too. Okay, and I did grease my hair, so I'm gonna try not to cut too far back because if I do it's just gonna start coming up. I like to grease my hair to protect my my edges and so sometimes it don't always stay like I would like it to on the corner. Mm -hmm. As you can see right there we're just gonna cut this I'm cutting the bristles. I'm gonna tie this in the back. This is still connected here, is it? Yes, it is. Okay. And then from here. Now that part is an easy fix. Um, this is my hairline because I like to protect my hair. So that is why we got that. And then we're going to go in for the quick fix here. Because that sucks. And here too, just away from everything. Now the back is what's going to be special because I'm not doing anything different than I would normally do. 
um, so we will see. As you can see, this thing is spreading out, but kind of weirdly, so whatever. So we got that out the way. Um, now we just gotta go ahead and line up this lace. You know what I'm saying?
Okay. We are going to put this in a quick ponytail like this. We are going to, for now, take our got to be glued right near the edges. Yeah, right under that. Okay, real quick, because my phone turns out it did not charge a bit. It was not plugged up the whole time. I, I tripped out on that one. I really did, but whatever. So we had this on there for a good minute. It's laid down pretty hard. I wanna just brush it back like that real good. Real quick. Okay. Okay, y'all, I'm back. And I know y'all gonna be proud of me if you get that brush because I literally just plucked the heck out of this wig to make it look natural. I also brought my tweezers in case I need to pluck it some more. Just to show y'all how much I plucked it. Cause your girl went in, like I went in. This is how much hair we just plucked off of this. And it was already like a natural looking frontal. So it wasn't too thick because it's curly. Now we're gonna get to the back. <laughs> Hair flying everywhere. Oh, yes, the back. I always like to make sure the front is laid. That's why I do so much here. I know my camera, my phone died, and it cut off on me that last part. So we still get to go back in with the same hot comb. And this time it's going to lay a little bit flatter because there's a little less hair in the front. I'm gonna go in and cut my lace. Y'all can see me there. Okay, as far as I'm concerned, that is great. Okay. 
I never need to cut with a razor again because I just did an okay but not a perfect job. That's all I'm gonna say. I need my lucky scissors. Okay. Um, the last part of our mission today since we have got most of that down, I know as you can see, I did not put any, um, I didn't put any makeup on my lace, no nothing. I have some mousse that I'm hoping is going to, you know, clear it up for us. And we can see if we can bring everything, you know. We go back in with our alcohol, because we put our scarf on. We don't want none of that extra glue to just kind of sit on our hairline, so... I am going to go ahead and put the mousse on here and then for the spritz. I also need to go ahead and get the back. So I said I was going to get the back ready real quick. Let me do that. Put my little baby hairs to the side and go in with this lace. the finishing steps which is spray the mousse here let me get my mirror so I can spray accordingly I'm talking about spray the mousse now truthfully this is the final step in the melting process. Period.
We got the most important part of this video finished. I still gotta clean up my room and stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this hair up, y'all. I'm gonna let this glue settle as much as it can. Put my stringy on here that y'all seen to hold it down as much as possible. And I'm gonna check in with y'all tomorrow after I get off the work. Okay. So I'm back and uh, I done did a whole shift. My day was okay if y'all care. And I'm just ready to go ahead and show y'all. Before I even do a reveal, I just want to let y'all know that I am absolutely in love with the product be sure to check it out because the link is going to be in my description i did the back of my hair and i don't know what it looks like so when i'm editing this video that's going to be my first time seeing it but yeah so i'm just like before i reveal it so the only thing i didn't do with y'all is my edges and i did the basic edges i think they call like feather edges or something i'm not too sure but i used the flat iron flipped it the other way got a little bit of mousse did my thing there and because it was 360 and they said in the description it can be styled then i figured that it would be better to show y'all the how good the quality of a wig it is by styling it how they stated in the ponytail because i've never had a wig styled in the ponytail and i did like i did that okay so i ain't gonna keep y'all waiting like because i know y'all ready for this reveal i cannot stress enough this hair is so good like this hair is so good i think it was called all heat hair all heat hair or something like that y'all did y'all thing y'all did y'all thing and y'all this wig is not expensive at all like it's inexpensive it is very very affordable so like if you're not going for inches and you're definitely going for natural go short and get you a ponytail see? okay let me start talking reveal it to y'all hold on so this is what we got and keep in mind before i even show you the back Wow. This is my first time doing a 360 lace install and I am pretty proud of myself. Like, y'all, look. Okay. Okay, can I get a, can I get a okay? Okay. Okay, so I think, yes. And I was gonna wear it like, you know, with it like that or however it go. But yeah, so that is just the actual lace because that's showing y'all the quality of lace. Make, and just to let y'all know, remember the part in my video, I did not put no makeup on my lace. I really didn't do nothing except what they show y'all that they do to melt it, which is like the basics. Oh, that little curvy part is supposed to go back here. So there is no makeup added on this at all because this time I just wanted to go without. So I went without makeup this time, and we still got a really good outcome. I was gonna do a little swoop right there, but I did, and I just didn't want to, I don't know. We still got a really great outcome though, so this is it. I would have to rate this like, like a, a, a eight or nine out of 10. I don't even know why I would give it that, because I would give it 10, but I've never did a 360, so I have to be fair game here, like before just giving y'all 10 out of 10. This is my first 360, and the quality of this lace is like lit, you know? lit so if y'all follow this detailed review this step by step and only thing i did without y'all was like the the edges so i'm sure you know if y'all want a video on that y'all can now this is the back i don't know what it looks like so here i installed this back y'all and i did the little the brush up thing back there so and i have hair like usually like on the little edges or whatever but I didn't do nothing with them at all. So that's what I was able to do. If you have a stylist, I'm sure that they'll be able to lay it down perfect for y'all, but I did not. I'm my own stylist. So that's what we working with. Overall, overall again, oof. I cannot stress enough. This, this wig is like an eight out of 10. Eight out of 10 is what I'm gonna give it. Cause yes, it's giving scalp. It's giving very much so natural. It's giving, okay. It's crazy. Cause we saved this wig for last because I was scared that it wasn't gonna turn out right. And if we being honest, out of this one and the other one, this one is definitely my favorite, like for sure, for sure. So y'all be sure, cause this is a quick review to check out that link in my bio. I'm going to do a week update on each one of them.
Y'all, this wig is so cute. This wig is so cute. Like, this wig is so cute. Okay. Well, thank y'all so much for watching, and I do hope y'all are having an amazing day. I do hope you enjoyed this review. As always, if you want this hair, the link is going to be down below. And every unit that I review is always going to be on my Amazon storefront. So, y'all be blessed with that. And also, don't forget, if you want to support my music, I'm going to drop my music channel for you. Yo, so, we'll get into that another time. But anyways, I'm going out tonight, y'all. And I want to have a good time. It's Saturday, so I hope y'all have a good time, too. Peace out. Okay, bye.